Okay, so it's the end of the week. Uh, I'll have a short little video of a piece of trash door operator again I've showed on here. A uh, couple updates. Had the helper back for one day and uh, he drove the elevator up after I put this on the rails above it to look at something. Didn't realize the 700 lumens wasn't part of the rails. Good kid though. But what I want to do is take a moment and look at this and this that a subscriber sent me, which is super cool. Um, I believe all the way from New Zealand, he sent me them. And this is very cool, like a uh, old Otis original doorstop tool. I've just been kind of keeping it in here. I'm not going to use it, but I like to show people, um, especially because I haven't met someone yet that have seen this before, right? Uh, retired mechanic from New Zealand, I believe. I got a great letter from him. Um, I'm not going to share his name or anything. If he wants to say something in the comments or whatever, that's cool. But uh, I did pick this guy up today, which is massive. I got the two panels out, trying to figure out how to set it up. Um, tomorrow morning, which will be Sunday morning, I got to go take a drive out. Um, so I'll be able to do a good video on that. Um, and also I got some of these screwdrivers. If anyone else watches Wrangler Star. And it, it is identical to Snap-on. The hard handles. And I got the Williams ratcheting screwdriver. And just like people say online. Which one is it? So this is like in the, in the Snap-on one you don't get that but there's the snap-on logo on the t15 i don't think any other one had that was the only one i noticed i don't know that one does too it is nice stuff uh, i got where did i get the five p screwdriver set the ratcheting screwdriver and i got this guy which is pretty cool Williams again uh, I think they have a couple different sizes of shank on this too but uh, pretty excited to play with those a little more um, yeah I'll get into this on another video but uh, let's get to that uh, disaster door operator okay so we're back at this piece where this shaft has moved right walking the belt out chain is falling off the problem is is it happened I had a video of it happening maybe two months ago we got it bet so it would work again for him because it's in an old folks home but then obviously the customer declines fixing it so and I was here taking measurements for it all so this is the pain where I'd like to just shut it off and force them to but then people can't get their meals and whatnot just creates a big disaster but let's see what we can do I got the chain back on I can't move this shaft this is all loose this won't move at all I was able to move that out a bit to get us close and I was able to move this out a bit to get us close there I'll have to roll that around and get it back in place but I've already spoke to the guys at the office and someone's gonna come out here tomorrow and tell them that this is ridiculous and we need to do something. So stay tuned to see if it actually works. <laughs> 